There we go. All ready. Fresh and ready. Do you what? <laughs> Did you brush your teeth? You need to brush your teeth. You can keep eating it after you brush your teeth. This is a difficult task to brush your teeth in the morning. But I'm gonna go in there and help him real quick. They seem to have done it. We have three people! Yep. Three people on. Good morning guys, my name is Trevor. Welcome back to the Archivet YouTube channel where today we discuss how long we are actually grounded. In other news, today is Thursday, September 9th, Cohen, thank you. In our Jesus Calling devotional book, it reads, walk with me along paths of trust. The most direct route between point A and point B on your life journey is the path of unwavering trust in me <clears throat> when your faithful faith falters you choose a trial that meanders and takes mediners meaner meanders menders that just doesn't sound right and takes you well out of your way you will get to point b eventually cohen has his training Cohen has his training wheels on. Yes, they see. You will get to point B eventually, but you will have lost precious time and energy as soon as you realize you have wandered from your trust path. Look to me and whisper, I trust you, Jesus. This affirmation will help you get back on track. The farther you roam along paths of unbelief, the harder it is to remember that I am with you. Anxious thoughts branch off in all directions, taking you farther and farther from my awareness of my presence. You need to voice your trust in me frequently. This simple act of faith will keep you walking along straight paths with me. Trust in me with all your heart and I will make your path straight. Whew. Man. So, okay, here's the reason Cohen has his training wheels back on. You might be wondering, like, dude, you can ride without them. Why do you need them? Well, we got that ramp for the bikes, you know. And uh, he wants to ramp the ramp again. So he needs his training wheels. And what do we have coming up here? This little car is, is burning. Damn. Oh, my gosh. Did you see that one? big wine gang <laughs> anyways we're off to school and off to work so man oh man and uh yeah about miss dora there i i've kind of got a feeling that nobody's gonna buy her like that which is totally fine is I'll take everything off of it, and I'm not, I still am not going to ask much less. They're lost, my game. That's that's how I see it. But anyhow, I still have to finish getting ready, so go into the bathroom and do just that. See, we still have a Corvette, guys. We still have a Corvette. We just upgraded. It's a bit dusty though. Oops. Wait, today's Friday. I'm no, it's not Friday. It's Thursday. It is Friday. Then you'll be ungrounded. Yep, that's right. You got grounded. Ouch. Roll that intro. Alright guys. I decided I'm going to show you guys a little bit of what we did today. First up was dug a hole to dig the post out and move it down. So that was two holes. 
I actually dug it three times because it wasn't close enough. And then here's the fourth hole. Dug a fourth hole for a nice little fence. But more importantly, this is the cool thing. And my buddy John, I, I would think he would be pretty proud of this work, how it, how it turned out. He could be the judge down in the comments. We put in a nice little electrical panel. Nice light switch. Ran all the cabling. You guys can see we got cabling for a light and another light. And then all the way down here, this is kind of where I came in, right? I put the Christmas lights in. <laughs> but seriously, we got some outlets put up here. And so, you know, it's pretty fun. Personally, I like wiring, so this is kind of my gig. And I was, I wanted to just make sure to show you guys. Don't mind my nice, like, bandana here. Keeps the sweat up out of my eyes, you know. I suggest it highly. <laughs> Anyways, let's get back to today's video. Whew. All right, guys, that was quite the day of work. And uh, boy, howdy. I'll tell you what, I'm starting to feel like Spider-Man. <laughs> Wait, why do I feel like Spider-Man? Oh, you know, I, I accidentally, well, I don't know if it's accidentally. I got bit by a spider, and you guys can see my nice outline that I drew around my reaction. It was pretty fast, and um, it burned a lot. But luckily, to some lavender, some doTERRA oil that we have, that I have, and that my dad and stepmom have at their house as well, I was able to put some lavender on it, rub it in. I did that like three times, and then... Well, here we are. It reduced the reaction. I didn't have to go spend a lot of money at the doctor. I didn't even have to go see a doctor. Clearly, I didn't die because, well, here I am. <laughs> Just saying. There are some miracle minerals, oils, things out there that are natural that God placed on this earth for you and I. And if you're interested in using them or learning more about them or knowing how, what to use, when to use it, go ahead and shoot me an email. Shoot me a message. Check out... Ka-chow! What a wee! Lightning McQueen, the one and only. Fastest race car in the earth. Ow. Now you have blood on you. What'd you do, just kill a mosquito? Yeah. Oh man. Look, now I'm dying from a skeeter. The skeeter got me. Anyhow, um, the the clip of work you guys seen in that shed, it's 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 no really funny. Nobody shut the door. That's how you know that we were all born in a barn. Thanks, Cohen. None of us were born in a barn, okay. <laughs> uh, my nose. So in this shed, it's it's a yard shed, so like all the mower, weed whackers, all that stuff goes in there. Well, if you guys know me, I am allergic to grass. However, we thought that maybe it was because we were getting to, into some insulation, but that insulation wasn't uh, fiberglass insulation, so it couldn't have been that. So what I'm saying here is that my arms, both arms completely, you can kind of still see it up here on my bicep there, maybe. I, I mean, I can't in person, maybe the camera doesn't catch it. But all the way, yes, you can have a popsicle on both arms, all the way up to my mid bicep there, I was breaking out. And I was like, I couldn't figure out why. I thought, well, maybe it's because of the, the wood that we're cutting up and uh, maybe that's affecting me. Like the shavings, because we had to drill holes and stuff. Nah, it wasn't that. It was, it was all the grass stuff in there, so dang it. But again, Lavender saved the day. I just went inside, washed my arms off, covered them in lavender, and uh, well, the itching got a lot less. And now, now that I am home, I'm going to change my clothes, hop in the shower, let this edit, this video export while I do so, and then upload it for you guys to view it right now. Like right now. You're watching it right now. And I'll be done with my shower already, obviously, so. Unless I could stay in the shower that long. 
Can you stay in the shower for 24 hours? <laughs> I mean, yeah. 24 hour challenge. Anyways, I just seen a funny post on Facebook and I, I don't know how we're gonna do it, but it's a clean your room challenge. And I think the boys need to do that. No. And I think before we do that though, we need to play daddy is the kid. So I go in their room and destroy it. And then they have to go and clean it. Let me know down below what you think. So we didn't drive the car? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. Your name's not Trevor. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so, anyways, I, I, Trevor. <laughs> I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I had something totally else, so, something totally different planned today. However, after going through and editing it, I was like, no, nah, I don't want to do that. I'm, I don't even know if I'm gonna put that live. It's, it, it's honestly just me ranting about some of the stupidity of people these days so it may never go out and it might however smash that thumbs up don't forget click the red subscribe button check out our merch down below we also have a patreon you can check that out thank you todd shout out brother thanks for joining our patreon and being part of it we will catch you all tomorrow in another daily arctic vet video god bless that bee is gonna sting you leave him alone it's not even a bee it's a beetle no it's not a beetle it's crawling as a beetle everything's a beetle that's a spider you look like a beetle 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 that's a spider it's a spider that is a weird looking spider maybe it's the one that bit me maybe it followed me home weird